Greetings from outer space. It's your host, yours truly, Jupiter Red, and I'm back with another video. So today I'm going to be going over a few steps on how to be an amazing girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Everybody wants to be one. Now this is specifically for people who are 18 and up, okay? Because I know a lot of people probably will come on here and y'all like fifth graders like, Oh, I want to be an amazing girlfriend. No, no, click off. This is not for you, okay? How to be an amazing girlfriend when you're your age is to not be a girlfriend at all, okay? Okay, bye bye. bye. So first things first, we're gonna start with taking care of yourself, okay? That means wash your body, wash your poom poom, wash your booty. Just have good hygiene, you know, if you wear makeup, put on makeup, you know, do your hair, Freaking, you know, wear nice clothes, just look nice. Don't get fat. What? what? It's, too, it's late too late for me. For me. It's not it's too late, late for you. you. And also take care of yourself mentally, okay? Make sure you know you're doing everything that you need to do to stay sane. Which brings me to step number two. Be a happy girlfriend. Do not nag, I repeat. Do not nag and be argumentative. If you are nagging or arguing over stupid reasons, he's not gonna wanna be with you. He's not. He's going to leave you. He can be by himself and not have to hear you nagging. He can spend $2,500 on one of them silicone <laughs> sex dolls that everybody's talking about. And I have to deal with that. Happy girlfriend means happy boyfriend, okay? That goes for guys too. Okay. Allow your partner to have some space. If he wants to go hang out with his boys, if he wants to play video games, or if he wants to watch the Lakers and the Cavaliers, let him, let him go find you something else to do. Go eat some Greek yogurt, go to the gym, freaking pet your dog, take a walk, you know, watch YouTube videos. Let him do him. Because when you give him space, you give him time to miss you so he can be all over you when the time is right. Give him little gifts. It doesn't have to be anything expensive. Since me and my boyfriend been together for so long, you know I'll be dropping some guava. But just get him, you know, little things here and there, you know, give him his favorite cologne if it's not too expensive or something like that, or his favorite food, you know, if he likes energy drinks, whatever, just, just buy him little stuff like that to let him know that you care and that you know what he likes. Next step is to communicate with him. Now, I struggle with this one because when I'm mad, I just like to stare evilly across the room at him. <gasps> but ladies, that's not gonna get you anywhere. How is he supposed to fix something that he doesn't know is broken? Tell him, tell him what's wrong. And another one a lot of people are gonna think is like sexist or something, but it's not sexist, okay? Uh. Excuse me. Cook for your man. I'm not talking about every night. I'm not even talking about nothing gourmet. If y'all wake up in the morning together, just go ahead, scramble him some eggs, put some bacon in the oven on 425 for 15 minutes, and pop some toast in a toaster, put some jelly on a toast, plate it, and give that bacon to that man, okay? In order to be an amazing girlfriend, cook for your dude sometimes, okay? Sometimes, not all the time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Be freaky. Mm. Ladies, you know what I'm talking about. This is why I said it's not for little girls. This is not for little girls, okay? You know what I'm talking about, ladies. You know what I'm talking about, ladies. All right, next, stroke his ego. Tell him he looks good. Talk about his muscles and stuff, you know? Uh. You know, tell him he look handsome. Tell him his beard getting thick and stuff. You know, the whole 
whole shebang. Just stroke his ego. Just make him feel good. Make him feel like a man. Now for the big finale. So now that you're doing everything else that I just said, he's totally in love. He's stuck. Here's your chance to unleash the beast. Be your true self. Be that evil crazy bitch that you've always wanted to be. Nah, I'm just kidding. Y'all thought I was serious, didn't y'all? That's what a lot of women like to do though. That's the only reason why I said it because a lot of these women will be like, oh, that would be awesome, girlfriend. And then they put a ring on it and they just <laughs> flip the script. The final step is to be consistent, okay? Do this for the rest of your life. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So now you know how to be an amazing girlfriend. Make sure you go out there and you be one girl better than his ex, better than his next. <laughs> he ain't gonna have a next cause I'm the best and he ain't gonna wanna move on from that. Thank you for watching and I hope you like this video. If you like this video, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up and don't forget to shoot that subscribe button to let me know you got love for me cause I got love for you. Join this family, boo boo join it the amazing girlfriend squad and if you would do the amazing boyfriend squad thanks again for watching and i'll see you next video